You've probably heard that you should only double mask under specific circumstances and that double masking can actually either improve your fit or hurt it. Uh, one of the things that's supposed to hurt the fit of a mask, like this N95 mask, is putting an, an, uh, a surgical mask underneath it. So today I wanted to find out just how true that is. And of course, this is basically an instrumented anecdote. So uh, a big study always takes precedence over little experiments like this. Okay, we're going to switch over to fit test mode and uh, give it a try. Fit factor 141. That's For me, with an 8210, that's a very good fit factor. All right, so now we're going to try the uh, surgical mask underneath. Okay, I've got the mask put on with the surgical under it, and I don't know how it's going to do. It's uncomfortable, uh, and it's kind of pushing at my eyes here. Uh, it does not feel better, but I don't know how the test will go. Well, fit factor is definitely not as good. Um, now, again, this is just one trial, so we can't really be sure if it always makes things worse, but um, at least in this instance, it did. Uh, it could have been just the fit of the, um, of the mask itself, the N95, or it could have and most likely was the surgical mask underneath interfering with the seal. Okay, this is gonna be a 3M Aura, a mask that generally fits me pretty well, and we'll use this as the control. Eight forty-two. So yes, the three Amoras do fit me really well. Um, don't want to mess up that fit, but I'm going to risk it with this uh, surgical mask. Okay, I've got a surgical mask under my three M Aura. The Auras fit so well. I think it's probably still going to fit okay, but not as good as it should. But I don't know. Let's find out. One fourteen. So uh, down from over eight hundred, I would say that the surgical mask definitely does not improve your fit factor if it's underneath. Now, as a bonus, let's see what happens when we stick one over, and whether that hurts the performance as well. Okay, in this configuration, I can test just the mask first without the uh, surgical on, and that way we test the same fit with and without the surgical to see whether it's the surgical that makes the difference. This methodology was not practical with the surgical underneath uh, because of the way the masks fit together. All right, let's give this a try. 796, okay, that's a, a good normal fit for me with this uh, 3M Aura. Let's see what happens when I stick the surgical mask over it. All right, and here we go. Ten thirty. I actually got a better fit factor with the surgical over the top. Um, that surprises me a little bit. Um, I have also tested uh, these uh, 8210s the same way, and I got the same results. But let's double check it. I'm gonna remove the surgical mask, and we're gonna test this to see whether or not the fit factor goes back down. Nine seventy, so it uh, went down from a little bit from having this over. Um, let's see whether or not this makes the difference again. All right, seven seventy eight, seven seventy seven. Um, results inconclusive. Uh, uh, what I will say though is that um, putting the uh, surgical over does not seem to dramatically uh, reduce the uh, fit of the aura like I would have expected. Um, it went up, it went down, uh, it seems kind of random almost. So it would need a lot more samples uh, before I could make any conclusions from that.